Hey guys, so I'm doing this video. I wanted to show you guys what I wore for the month of March. I got my period March 9th through March 12th. Let me double check that. No, March 14th. Sorry. I have it on my app right here. It's Glow. That's the app I use. So I wanted to come on here and talk about all the cloth pads that I used. And so, yeah, let's get started. I'll start with my lights. I used this flannel topped, wool backed pad that I made. I made this. It was like one of my very first, um, when I was starting out making my own pattern, I made this and it, I still use this shape to this day. And it was the very first time I used wool, so I really like it. That I made cotton topped, um, micro fleece backed, one layer of bamboo, this lovely snippet, um, lovely, I think that's lovely snippets, snippets, yes, I think I'm pronouncing it, um, cotton topped anti-pill fleece backed, I love this one, this rumps love cotton topped anti-pill fleece backed, This one that I made, this cotton topped micro fleece back. And this one is really stained, so <laughs> sorry. I have a bunch of farmer stain stick on the way, so this, yeah, look how bad that is. This um, cotton topped wind block um, fleece backed pack. So on to my light days. I used this Yurt Craft. Pad. This has two stars. I love this one. Use this. Oh, this is cotton topped wind pro fleece backed. Sorry. This cotton topped wind pro fleece backed llama pad. This also has two stars. I watched that one. Did you watched that movie? Yeah. This flannel topped micro fleece backed pad that I made. And this. Jersey topped anti pill fleece um, Empire Lush pad. That's what I've come to conclusion that this is. I really like this pad. Now on to my regulars. I used a lot of regulars this month, like I always do. So let's just get started. This cotton topped fleece backed pad that I made. The wind is like going crazy over here. This cotton topped anti pill fleece backed pad that I made. This cotton topped anti pill fleece backed pad made by me. So I made it. Cotton topped um, micro fleece backed pad made by me, cotton topped fleece backed pad made by me, cotton topped anti pill fleece back pad made by me, <laughs> cotton topped fleece back pad made by me. <laughs> This velour topped pad, fleece backed, made by me. Cotton velour, super soft. It's purple, it's like a dark purple. This verse, this this pattern is actually from Thess the Thessalation pad from Verse Style. So I bought it off Etsy and I made a few. So this is cotton topped, fleece backed. Pad made by me. I love this. Cotton topped fleece backed made by me with the um oops it's upside down mini mouse. I love it. And then another top favorite I definitely think has to be my top is this peacock cotton topped fleece backed made by me. I love this one. 
love how this turned out. So. Um, can't remember who, what this is, but I wore this one. This was um, from Jamie. I, I, from a D stash. I bought it from Jamie. Uh, I cannot remember who the maker is, but this pad, uh, jersey, or knit, anti pilfy backed. Knit Pink Lemonade Shop, Wind Pro Back. I gave this pad another shot, so I will definitely have to do a review. This Mama's Couture, OBV Topped Wind Pro Backed. <laughs> this po Poshy, po Posy Peach, Posy Peach, not really sure. Uh, knit Topped with anti pill fleece backed um and it has two stars right here so love this can i see which two stars two stars right there see see one two How this rigid flame cotton topped wind pro fleece wind pro fleece packed pad This Annie Bell's Essentials OBV Top Twin Coat Back. This Your Craft Cotton Top Twin Pro Back. Three stars right here. I'm still on my regulars. <laughs> this Hoo Hoo Rags Cotton Top Twin Pro or Wind Block Fleece Back. Whoops. This Rump's Love Cotton Topped Wind Pro Fleece Backed. And another Rump's Love Cotton Topped Wind Pro Fleece Backed. Now on to my heavies. Shoo wee. Alright, so on to my heavies. My heavies I wore this Hoo Hoo Rags Cotton Topped Wind Pro Fleece Backed. This year craft cotton topped wind pro backed four stars it has four stars on it. This New England's Patriots pad that has four stars. It is cotton topped and wind pro black wind pro back fleece. This pad made by me cotton topped. Fleece back. This pad made by me, cotton topped fleece backed as well. Now on to my overnights. Here we go. This cotton topped fleece backed made by me pad. The unicorn is like so sane, you can tell. <laughs> This cotton topped fleece backed, made by me. Little. This cotton topped fleece backed, made by me. Stained. This hoo hoo rags. Careful, baby. This hoo hoo rags pad, cotton topped, wind block fleece. I have a blue ribbon. And then this 13 inch hoo hoo rags cotton top wind block fleece. At first, I didn't really think that I was going to like this pad at first, but um, if you can read that, it says, Let's be friends forever and ever. And so I really, really love this pad. Um, it's very vintage to me. So I didn't think I'd like it at first, but I, I really did fall in love with it. And then I also made myself some interlabial pads. Um, these are right now going on a special with my store, not to brag about my shop, but um, I'm throwing in interlabial pads for free for the next few purchases made um, at my store because just to test them out and give them to people. So I made a few for me. I made this flannel one, flannel <laughs> with flannel back. Covering your mouth. 
bamboo jersey on one side, flannel on the other. Let me see. Jer another bamboo jersey with flannel. Thank you. Knit on one side and flannel on the other. And then, hang on, let's see. This was a heart shape that I just kind of made. Um, somebody asked for it, so I made it. This is knit on one side and flannel on the other. And then I made, I redid the shapes. So this is the larger shape, and then this is the smaller shape. So if you can see that, they're quite, let me see, quite different in size. Let me see. Yep. So I have a larger shape and then a smaller shape. So, I mean, it just depends on what you prefer, I guess. So I made these two. These are bamboo knit with flannel. I also changed the stitch. Um, the stitching that I used for these um, wasn't really a big fan of. So I, I redid the stitching um, when I was making different, redoing them. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. I will get off here because I have crazy toddler running around the place. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and we will talk to you guys soon. Bye.